Hey there, Chad Barnes here for Ohio University Libraries. In this quick video, I'm going to show you how to do a basic cross tabulation using the Simmons Insights platform. Doing a cross tab in Simmons allows you to compare multiple variables across multiple criteria, looking at whatever kind of key demographic or consumer characteristics you want. It's a great way to kind of really identify some trends in uh, what consumers prefer and look for ways in which product categories and interest and demographics may overlap or tie in together to influence uh, purchasing behavior or, or uh, project like the demand for a particular product in a particular area or per, per, perhaps uh, project like how uh, uh, successful a sponsorship may be or something like that. So once again, this shows how to use Simmons Insights to do a cross tab. So here you go. When you first get to Simmons, you'll be asked to log in with your name and email address and assign a role. In this case, I'm going to log in as Rufus Bobcat and I'm going to proceed uh, into Simmons. After we log in, we're taken immediately to the cross tab, which is where we need to be. For the sake of my, uh, de my um, demonstration here, what I want to do is compare uh, fans of Major League Baseball and NBA basketball and look at um, the types of restaurants they might like to eat at the most. And I would be using this kind of data to basically determine ideal positions for a potential sponsorship. So let's start off with our sports interests. So let's say M MLB Very, and let's look at people who are very interested in Major League Baseball, and we'll put that in our column. And once we do that, it puts it over here on our left-hand side for us. We did the same thing for NBA Very, and here we have people who are very interested in NBA basketball. We'll put that to our columns as well. Now we have two things in our columns, and then for our rows, that's what we're going to compare against. We're going to put our restaurants in there. So let's look at, maybe let's look at McDonald's. People eat at McDonald's the most. Okay, let's go and put that into our rows. Let's look at uh, Chick-fil-A and visit the most. Once again, put that to your rows. And then uh, let's look at... Um, We'll go a little upscale here on the quick service fast casual and look at Panera Bread, visit the most, and put that into our rows. All right, so you can see the things are in our rows, things are in our columns, we're happy with that. If we want to edit that, we can go over here and click on one and click edit, or we can delete if we want to do that as well. So what I'm going to do is go over here and click on run analysis, and this will go in and do our cross tab for us. Now, I am not incredibly crazy about this particular um, view. Uh, matter of fact, I like to change the chart type over here to a cross tab view. I find it's a little bit easier to look at. I mean, you're welcome to use this one and kind of scroll. You just have to scroll. and It's a little bit sluggish um, to scroll. Sometimes it wants to go and sometimes it doesn't. And so I like to use, to use the cross tab view here. Okay. A little bit easier for me to look at, and it and the scroll seems to work just fine with the scroll wheel on your mouse. Okay, so the way you read this thing, and we'll just go through a couple examples, is uh, let's look at um, let's look at uh, Chick Fil A because that looks a little bit more interesting than, than McDonald's here. Okay, so what I'm going to look at is maybe let's start with NBA basketball. And because we're starting at the top, we're going to use the vertical percent to read this. Okay, so we say of those people who are very interested in national in uh, the NBA, they're basketball fans, very interested in basketball. Eleven point three percent of them eat at Chick Fil A the most. Okay, if we compare that with of those people who are very interested in Major League Baseball, seven point nine percent of them eat at Chick Fil A the most. Okay, versus the national average of everybody who took the survey, 8.1% of them said they eat at Chick-fil-A the most. Okay, so it looks like NBA fans are more likely to eat at Chick-fil-A than either Major League Baseball fans or just a general population. So that's pretty interesting. Okay, so, uh, so let's look at um, another way to read this. So let's read from uh, right to top. And to do that, we're going to look at the horizontal percent. Okay. So the way you read this is of those people who eat at McDonald's the most, 13.6% of them are very interested in Major League Baseball. Of those people who eat at McDonald's the most, 
10% of them are very interested in NBA. Okay, so that tells one side of the story. The other side of the story, if we start at the top and use the vertical percent, we can see the vertical percent are pretty flat, right? So those are kind of pretty even there. But if we, if, if you're looking at it from the horizontal perspective, you can see that um, people eat at McDonald's are more likely to like um, uh, be baseball than basketball. So that's a basic way to, to look at a cross tab report. Uh, while you're in here, you can go up here and ex export this to an Excel file. And this gives us a nice Excel file with, um, with basically the same kind of cross tab. Of course, we can go in and change the, the width of our, of our columns and that sort of thing. But it gives you the basic kind of uh, cross tab that we saw that we can download and put into our, our PowerPoints or, or, or uh, format how we, how we wish. So again, basic, basics of how to do a cross tab in Simmons Insights. So hopefully that was helpful to you.